All right, just do it again. <laughs> Live, Fast Master Classic, day two, day one, sort of. We did the pros yesterday. Uncle Larry Outdoors, we're back. More interviews presented by Fat Bass. Catch bass with class. Get some big bass. Let's go. <laughs> we showed up, no microphone this year. First order of business, find a microphone. It's really nice outside. I kind of want to just hang out. Lemonade. Oh, we're starting off no mics. No mics because we can't find anything. No mics, just a finger in the face. Let's go see what happens. Camus. Camus, is that the first stop? Yeah. Are we going head head first? Head first into the fray. <laughs> Once more. Once, Once more, more into the fray. <laughs> into the last good fight. I'll ever know. Live and die on this day. Oh yeah. Alright. How y'all doing? You guys wanna get into it to win some tires? Tires? That's nah, expensive. I mean, that sounds like, expensive. I look, I got a new wheel on the like way. Honda, 06 Honda. You make tires You got a tire on it, we make it. All right, all right. So like, what do we got to do? Oh, no, no, no. We don't do the yeah, iPad stuff. Look, you, ain't, you ain't even you get to know me mean. first. You ask the names. Mm -hmm. What else should I ask? I mean, that's the first thing. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Yeah, but like, all right. So what you is, might be what selling is this? me into what is this? some information. I mean, I could be like, what's the last four of the social in the CC? Right. I got you. You wouldn't get much off of that. I tell you. I tell you that. We're here with Hercules Tires. Oh, that was really cute. That was in really unison. Weird. And what are your names? What are your names? Sasha, Alana. Sasha and Alana. Where are we from? Uh, originally Trinidad, but I live in Orlando. Originally Jamaica, but I live in Atlanta. Why y'all move here? Like that's. When I was young. For that the money. My choice. For, for the money. money. Want to move back? Now, yeah. Definitely, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> like, we're like, right. out of Earth. <laughs> like, I think we just go by, like. What's your name? Johnny. Johnny. Yeah, okay. isn't it? Oh, no, that's great. Okay, Johnny boy, come through. Okay, Johnny. We're going to be coming through. We're going to be coming through. <laughs> but I was thinking, we go by, like, 20 scratches, the okay. $50 ones. Okay. Because, like, you can win up to, like, I don't know, like, 10 grand on those. Okay. So, if one hits, first class, do we go to Trinidad or Jamaica? Both. What are we doing down in Trinidad? What are we not doing though? We whining. <laughs> we dining, we whining. You got soca, you got good What's food. soca? Soca music. Like soca. reggae. Okay. That's what they play like the carnival. I gotta get more limber, I yeah, feel like. Yeah, I gotta relax a little bit. Uh -huh. I know. Gotta, so come I on, Johnny. Because see, like, I got that, like, bad external you rotation. Gotta more, you gotta, like, put your I know, it's because I'm too it, tall, I think, you know. Yeah. Give him a soca lesson. Give him a soca lesson. You gotta give him a soca lesson. That's extra. That's extra. This is only the first day. Well, what is this called? Like, what's your... Uncle yeah. Larry Outdoors. Uncle Larry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Where he at? <laughs> Yo, what's up, huh? <laughs> no, no, oh, no. I you ain't about to turn him to your sugar daddy. No, no. Excuse me? Is Ted Youngblood still with Camus? You're asking the wrong person. But your, 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 your shirt says Camus. Yeah, it does, but I do their marketing. No, oh, no, I, I see. You might be the person You're trying to hand us off. I see what's happening. Ted Youngblood? Damn. Did he give us a fake name? A lot of people who buy boats don't actually fish. Like they say they fish, but like the real fishermen are poor. Who are y'all with? Uh, Uncle Larry Outdoors. Uncle Larry Outdoors. One and yeah, only. Believe it or not, we're like... Yeah, I'll show you. Yeah, yeah. You'll know who we are after this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me show we you. Bother we bother Camus every year. year. It's crazy that you see him and you're like, he's a real person. He is. I saw him in the wild. It's yeah. crazy. You know what else Travis believes is in the wild? What? Uh, cryptid creatures. Sasquatch, one, Mothman. No. You believe in that? I mean, I've, let's see, in the last eight years since the, uh, you know, your cell cameras came out for like deer hunting, mm -hmm. I, I do have three pictures of Sasquatch. You being legit? Mm -hmm. Oh, man. My wife actually told me I wasn't allowed to deer hunt with my son anymore. I said, sweetheart, we have a gun. Like, don't, don't worry, we'll shoot him. It. It'll, it'll be okay. You're serious? I'm serious. Well, I, where are you at? Where do you live, Georgia? Uh, I live in Chattanooga. Oh, so are these? Yep, yep, yep. Wow. Can I, can I ask can, you a question? Yes. The feral people. Oh, you heard about bro. the feral people? Of course, he lives in Chattanooga. He knows about the feral people. Can you tell us a little about the feral people? Man, not on camera. We went to Chattanooga area, and we found some like little reservoir in the woods one day, and we like, yo, let's just go drive up into the mountains and find this little reservoir, and go hiking through the woods and next thing you know we see like disemboweled boars and burning toys and trash everywhere and like animal bones of who knows what then we heard dogs barking towards us we're like let's probably get out of here and we see some dude in a peg leg with a shotgun literally hobbling up at our car you have a banjo 
Uh, no, it wasn't like, it was like Deliverance minus the banjo. Is this a skunk ape or is this a Sasquatch? It's pretty big. I mean, he's, he's probably 6'4", we'll say about 300 pounds. Mm. About a size 19 shoe, I'd say, based on the tracks we went looked at the next what, day. What color was the fur? Um, How would you describe it? Well, it had a lot of mud in it, but it was... Uh, like matted? It was, was it matted? It was. It may smell bad. Yo, this you is... Could, yeah, yeah this I've is heard that. too real. Yeah. This is all Jake says. Yeah. It's all the stuff Jake says. This is getting deep. Yeah, all getting all deep. the pictures I've had have been post-pandemic. I'll just say that. Oh. That, well, that makes the plot thicken. I mean, that's that's a really interesting observation. Because things have been getting crazy out here. Things are I, like, crazy. It's funny, because like, we come to the Classic, we all pretend like they're not crazy for three days. And then you're like, you know, the craziest thing is about all of this is like, we're paying guys like Uncle Larry Outdoors and Travis Manson. It's like, yeah, the world's pretty crazy. That's a beautiful thing, isn't and it? That is, that it's is, amazing. Yeah, That's what it's about, about man. Well, we'll be yeah. back to bother you soon, sir. It was a pleasure. All right, guys. Uh, yeah. What was your name again? Shane. Shane. Okay, Jules, give us your your go-to Taylor Swift album. Fred. I'm a huge Red fan. I was going to come up with something more, more creative, but I saw the Red Tour three or four times. I went with a suit. Okay. You ever, you ever seen her live? I have. That was my first concert. All too well. I was 13 years old. First concert. Did you cry? Oh my god, so precious. Well, all too well. I got a little. It's precious. You got a little teary eye. Have you seen John Wick? No. John Wick, never. Want to go see John Wick four? No. Well, that's fine. Cause <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You know what, Jules? She wants to go see John Wick. Yeah, she does. Excuse me. Have you seen John Wick? Mm -mm. Never. Who's John Wick? Great question. Want to see John Wick 4? How long's the movie? It's, like, it's actually kind of long. Then probably not. I'd probably fall asleep. Do we have to go to the movie theater for it? Yeah. Then no. Is it's that like, it? If we didn't go to the movie theater, you'd be down to see John Wick? Potentially. We can deal with that. We can deal with that. Yes, sir. This crew, right? Oh, here. yeah. This crew. What's it's up, <laughs> buddy? When is Luke Duncan live party? So. It will not happen if you are not at it. Oh, no, we, okay. that's why we're asking. Yes. Yeah. So, seven-ish. When? Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night, night at the Hill Barn Grill. Hill Barn yes. Grill. The I think Hill we were Barn around Grill. that last night, Probably. I think. Are you guys performing? This yeah, year? we're playing, yeah, dude. Yeah, you opening up with AC true. again? If I'm playing music, you're opening up I'm with open, AC. I'm oh, oh, well, we've got to make sure and we're on time. you got to be there. Oh, we'll yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Two Fort years ago, you saved our whole classic crowd. What? Oh, yeah. Birmingham? No, Fort Worth. Fort Worth. Like, yeah, we forgot my ID, and they, 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 they were not going to let us in, yeah, yeah, yeah. and you're like, put the boys in. in. Yeah. 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 The Bur I remember Birmingham, too. It was wild. Yeah. I remember you singing Atlantic City at the top of your damn lungs. I'm like, Johnny's my dude. Yeah. Right up front, like I wrote it. I was like, Bruce. It's a total moment. Are you doing anything with Pat Renwick up no, on stage? No, no, Shannon oh, Wheeler. Okay, yeah, Shannon yeah, Wheeler. Yeah, yeah, yeah we're gonna keep Pat as far from the stage. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. He wants. To, him and I were supposed to do a meatloaf song together. It's odd. Yeah, yeah. Like, really. and I love meatloaf. So, do you guys know how to play a couple meatloaf songs like back to the back of your mind? Don't like, know how to play any meatloaf. Okay. What the f is meatloaf? Shut the f what? No, I don't. No, y'all gotta school uh, me. Yeah. You're gonna like, sell uh, Miracle Genius. Bad out, out of hell. hell. Bad out of hell. I'll be gone when the morning comes. No. Paradise by the Look dashboard. Bad out of hell. I'll be gone and no. I'll be gone. No. gone Y'all gotta put gone. me on, man. You gotta put me on. Dude. Paradise by the dashboard light, buddy. No, it's man. About, yes, it's about I am just uncultured swine. Oh. Paddling through what looks like dry ground to get to no, the No, literally. Literally. Just, that's just it. out there. That's muscle. all I know. Dude, that's, that's all, all I know. All Love talks about is the grind. Yeah, that's it. And like, that's what it's about. the life yeah. that he's trying to live. And like, In a more theatric way than yeah. Springsteen, though, right? That's fair. I would say so. Yeah. 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 He's like, made to me, a man. Broadway show about his album. And his name's Meatloaf? Meatloaf. his band. Yeah. No, he's meatloaf. It's he just him. He's dead now, oh, actually, yeah. to be R fair. R I P what do they call you, Spank? Uncle do you want to hop in the interview? Oh. Yeah. Why do they call me Spank? The little fat, kid, uh, little fat kid on Little Rascals. 
No way. I swear. Spanky? I've had it since sixth grade. Is is he the one who does the, I got a dollar, I got a dollar. Nope. No, that's okay. No, that's not me. Which one's Spank, though? Like, what does he do? The, the, fat, the only fat <laughs> kid on Little Rascals. Does he have, like, a signature move or anything? That's Chunk. Oh, that's Chunk. That's Chunk from the goodies. <laughs> that's Chunk from the goodies. All right, you're, getting, that... you're getting your old-time TV mixed up. <laughs> How old are you, like, 12? I'm a low-lifer. Puerto Rico. What is that? What is, that? What is, like, the low-lifer thing, like, can we get some clarification? Because, low like, I'm bringing I, it back in. It should be a compliment. Good to see you, bro. Like, I know it's not negative because you're the most positive sounds guy like ever. A, sounds, sounds like an like insult, yes. right? Right. Well, people just started calling themselves that. Like, the fans of the podcast, which yeah. is weird for me to say. I feel like it's weird to say you have fans. Well, they show up and like party that. with you every year. They That's do, weird. but they call themselves low lifers. Like they started popping up in the comments. I'm a low lifer. I'm like, what? That's sick. low lifer. Yeah, I never. Yeah, you know, what I didn't remember the Millicans, like the MFers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of yeah, sort of. yeah. Well, you see, you see, you we know, gotta, we got to come up it's with like something. like deadheads. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, except not as cool. What could we be besides like, I don't know. Like, what are our fans like? Addicts? <laughs> I think no. we gotta we gotta think on that one. Here's the we gotta ponder on that one. Our creative name be Yeah, like, help oh. us out, Luke. Help us out. What could the Uncle Larry gang be like? All them real ones at home. The nephews, dude. The nephews. nephews! Come on, you're Larry's welcome. You nephews. got it. This brain never stops. The only thing Yo. is Mike drop, wow. Mike drop on nephews. Come on, dude. If we do that, then we gotta get a Snoop Dogg endorsement. We gotta get Snoop on board. Nephew? Only thing nephews is it sort of implies like little boys. I <laughs> 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 Maybe like, you just do Larry's. Like. <laughs> Yo, we gotta think on that. We gotta think on that. We gotta give it another night. We gotta ponder. For legal, pur for legal purposes. For legal purposes, I would just like to say I did not come up with, with nephews. nephews. So, uh, we were looking for a microphone, right? And I just see you got those like collapsible paddles. If you want some free TH Marine shout out, we could click this right you. onto a paddle. I got you. I got you. Wow. Yeah. 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 Wow. And this is why we waited. Yes. This is why we waited this for finding a microphone. Wow. Today. This, this is, is, uh, is game-changing. Luke, thank you, man. All you nephews out there, be sure to hit that. Yeah. <laughs> if I come up with the best Zen marketing promotion for the classic, would you let me do an interview spot? Well, we're technically not allowed to promote nicotine. Well, who's, who said anything about nicotine? <laughs> That's what Zen is. But you're not allowed to promote nicotine, and yet... You're not allowed to push the product or promote it all around. So well, you could have a marketing slogan, right? Hey, how are you? Oh, excuse me. It's the only cool miner. To my knowledge, this is the only cool one. No, I think you forgot about Wyatt, though. No, you forgot yeah, about Wyatt. Oh, wait, Wyatt. You forgot about Wyatt's Wyatt. Wyatt's a little bit cooler than me. Bro. We can agree that. Oh my, that was oh, sick. Got some stuff Did you beat that. Nolan in both tournaments so far this year? Beat him in one, not the other. But you, you, if if you look at overall tournament winnings this year, yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm like tripling him right now. Yeah, so. it's not even close. Yeah. Most successful kayak fisherman. Me. Tuna fisherman. Wyatt. Womanizer. Wyatt. Money. Probably Wyatt. Ooh. He's got the best best place in, in God's heart. Nolan. <laughs> Nolan? Your mom's heart. Me. <laughs> Who's going to drive the coolest car? <laughs> Wyatt. Most humble. Nolan. Biggest douchebag. Wyatt. Was, <laughs> I would have said no. I would have said Nolan for least humble. Wait, how 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 not humble are you and why? I mean, Nolan just he never brags about anything. He just goes and he. Nolan never brags. <laughs> Nolan never brags. Bro, at least not around me. You're kidding me, right? Well, I guess he's got to humble himself to you because you're better than him. Straight yeah. up. Like, <laughs> just a little bit. Better than him, better looking. You got the red hair, the red stash. This is the thing. Like, we haven't talked about this yet, but my whole goal in life is to push Nolan further. Like, I am like the devil in his ear that's supposed to drive him to do the right thing. So, this is all coming from a loving place. He needs a little bit of. Push. I was sent with that purpose. What do you think you could pick up from us, fishing wise? I mean, really, just just finding all the sneak holes and stuff off the beaten oh, trespassing path. Trespassing stuff. Yeah. Do a little bit of that. But there's not as many opportunities to trespass. Well, there always East are. Tennessee. Oh, I would beg to differ. I there's would just say that the consequences are more severe. <laughs> Brody? You know I'm about to get my brunch. Oh, are, you in, are you in line for food? Well, I already ordered, but... Oh, okay. Yo, what is this Japanese ice cream shirt, bro? 
Oh, this is fire. Oh, bro. Bro, this is that's nice. that's, that's that drill. Ooh. Minor challenge. He gets to pick one person, anyone at all, for me that I have to go approach. You, you got 220 seconds to find them, starting now. Wait, no, we need some like some uh, music in between. Funk me, 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 searching through the classics for another victim. I'd say you have about 90 seconds remaining, Ewan. Oh, man. He's, he's nervous, look. He's fitting in with the shorts, he's nervous. Oh, too easy, too easy. Too easy, too easy. Coach Sales, have we met before? Uh, probably not. Well, we got are you sure we haven't met? We probably have somewhere, yeah. I don't know, because we know all the Carson... Are you a fisherman for Carson Newman, or are you a coach? Uh, I'm the coach there, yeah. Rumor has yeah. it they let you fish there for, like, what, 12 years post-undergrad? Yeah, as long as you, like, keep enrolling in, like, you know, kayaking or... Uh, what else do we have? Rock climbing and stuff like that. You can just stay or in. If you, like, if you buy like a dugout hat, you could just keep fishing on. Yeah. Well, dugouts are like you, you graduate immediately because we try to get rid of you pretty quick. No, I'm kidding. No, I'm kidding. No. <laughs> that was good. Coach Sales, who's your best fisherman behind uh, you? My best fisherman. Rank these three. Rank these three. <laughs> these these three are from other schools and they're all like zero, dude. They're all zero. Yeah. Huh? We fish for that college. Lander for L. Is that a real place? <laughs> oh, there you go, there you go. I'm Christopher Daniels. You, you, I'm you know, guys, I'm close to me, bro. Six feet. I got you, you know, I got you. <laughs> Liam Worley. I'm Drew Pridgen, I'm the coach. Favorite Pokemon? Uh, Natu. Unpopular opinion, but Natu. 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 Yes, sir. That's interesting. Natu. That's an interesting like choice. That. Psychic. Now, do you, do you find a lot of similarities between fishing and Pokemon? Oh, uh, yeah, man. i got to catch them all. <laughs> Bro, Carson Newman stuff, is in oh, hot you, no, water you this you. year if they got to go up against Liam. <laughs> Liam knows his stuff, bro. Okay. I'll take it easy, man. That's it? You're done with us? <laughs> hey, you got that's more what, questions? That's I'm what down. she said to me I'm last time. I think questions? you need to run this. I think, yeah, okay, you run it. Nah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all, I got an idea. <laughs> we, we running around? Yeah, yeah let's, let's go. go. Let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs> This is great for Lander University. Yes, sir. Right. This is amazing for call. Lander. You want me to point someone out that would be good for you? Anybody. Okay. Let's do... I can talk to pros, I don't care. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, bro, believe me. We, yeah. we, we, we I interview people at ICAST, so oh, okay. it, was, it was a Oh, move. dude, this guy's experience. Yeah. His resume speaks for itself. He's I'm on the clock. I'm a volunteer employee for the hour. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, we, just, oh, oh, you, we, could, we could have you be part of the game, too. What's okay, game? so your part of the game is you have to tell Liam who he has to interview. You get to pick yeah. any person. Pick oh. anybody in There's here. There's Epstein. <laughs> yeah. Where? Oh, Where? Mickey. Oh. He's working the phone. Dude, I saw the phone. Sarah! <laughs> Liam, interview Sarah. No. Why not? Yes. <laughs> yeah, no, this is great. Give me a reason why I can't interview you and I won't interview you. Because you have to sign an NDA if you want to party with the queen. Oh. Maybe I'm not of age to party, so who knows? <laughs> this guy's a natural. You're just a baby. You're just, just a baby. Natural. I'm 22, but okay. yeah. Okay. I'm just, I'm just trying you. All right. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> this is great. That's the Howdy, howdy. How are you doing? I'm all, I'm well. How are you? Good, real good. Yeah. What what you about today? Well, we are just trying to uh, explain how the world's actually going to end in 2040. Yeah. Yeah. It's called so the reset. Metaphysics it happens every 138 years. <laughs> oh, this kid's uh, okay. Yep. Reset. Well, is that we'll anything reset. like the Avatar movie? Nothing like it. The Way of the Water was a good movie, though. Did I didn't watch it. it, no. No? I feel like that's something it could be. What else is going on? There's a Bassmaster Classic going oh, yeah, on. That that's going not on. the end of the world. It's pretty it fun. No, we, we got, what, 18 of these left? So I'm just trying to enjoy every one that I can <laughs> yeah. between now and 2040. They're trying to do a Bassmaster show on Netflix. You think that's going to blow up, make bass fishing like the next F1, the world sport? I doubt it. It's probably going to end up more like uh, the MLF right now. MLF? Yikes. What are your final thoughts? Yeah, final thoughts, I just, I want everyone not to get nervous, uh, but be prepared <laughs> and just know that it's coming. <laughs> I got the bunker, I got I got my provisions ready, I'm ready to rock. Dude. Well, the bunker's not really gonna help, so the phenomenon's more, uh, you're gonna have volcanic, what's gonna happen is the- um, Did you watch The Last of Us with Pedro Pascal? Yes, but the, when the vapor canopy returns, we're actually gonna grow, gonna uh, our offsprings will actually be giants, just like they had in the past. So here in Tennessee and Kentucky, you guys are probably aware, unless you know the Smithsonian has covered up a lot of this stuff, 
but the giants that used to walk North America, they're they're being like they're they're being hidden by us, and that's the exact thing going to happen when the vapor canopy returns. We're going to have a lot more atmospheric pressure. There's actually going to be no wind. That's one of the reasons why the deep state right now wants us to go to solar and electrical because they want us dependent on those when the reset happens because they know it's coming. I swear to God, I swear to God, I've seen UFOs off the coast of South Carolina. But so the thing is, they're, they're, they're talking about looking up in the sky. These UFOs are not coming from the sky. There is no space. That's a simulation. What you're seeing, these UFOs, these objects are coming actually from the Great Lakes. Lake Ontario for one, Little Galoo Island. I've seen these UFOs come out of the water. They're coming out of the water. The government wants us to look up at the sky and think that they're coming from the sky and there will be a false flag from the sky, but it's not going to be from UFOs. UFOs. They pop up and play leapfrog with each they other, is what I've seen. Absolutely. Orange lights going boop, boop, boop. Absolutely. So all I'm saying is, uh, you know, it was wonderful hanging out with you guys. I got I to gotta run. Thank you for your time. Absolutely. It was well done. You might be our first hire. I discovered you. We actually got to speak with this bitch. She's going to give us money Japanese to hire. Japanese bass man? Japanese you know bass. Japanese bass yeah. Shout out Alex. Shout out, out Alex. Send me to Tampa. Tampa. Pull up, bro. Pull up. I'm to Tampa. Liam. I'll come Good to Tampa. Good to meet you, brother. Yeah, man. And just when I thought I was out, Miss Vic pulls me back in. Miss Vic, can we get our spot this year? Your spot? What's our interview your spot? spot. Oh, what are you going to interview me about? Well, I don't know. It's the same thing every year, right? Oh, you're actually doing it right now? Yeah. Oh. It's a whole lot about nothing. Wait, Lacey, come on over. You do it every year. No, yes, you do. <laughs> yes, you do. Look, look, you can't even escape me this year. It's Are you an expert on UFOs? Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we've seen a lot of them. You're dressed much nicer. You got a logo. You're doing good. What would give us your sales pitch, Cast King? Uh, affordable innovation. Affordable innovation. Yep, it's uh, excellent product at a real affordable price. So you can afford to have a lot of gear in your boat and not just one or two. Affordability is relative now. What kind of price point are we talking? Uh, well, probably the quality of four or five hundred dollar reel for about two hundred bucks, one hundred fifty bucks. Oh, you should go that. see them. We got the lightest. Wait, can you give us? Can you sell us real quick? Yeah. Come, sell us. Come sell us. Come sell us. Come sell us. I like the microphone placement. Thank you. What makes this reel different is the dead bolt. There's no star drag. Uh huh. Maximum drag, constant, all the time. Can't back it off. Nice hat. What did she put on? Yeah, I don't even know. I don't. Even, I didn't feel nothing. It's a good looking. I just hat. honestly like. Oh. Lean with it, rock with it? Oh, yeah. Oh, stop it. Are you kidding? Hold on. Hold it's like it's like the LeBron hat, dude. Yeah, dude. This is like all hail the king. Oh, this is fire. Yeah. All right, let's get back to it. Really interesting. Like, I don't know why other other brands doing this. Not yet. Why not? Like, it makes sense. I don't know. Right? Because what's the first thing you do when you grab a reel? I lock the drag. Right. Yeah. And the only time that drag comes on a plane is when it slips or loosens up and you don't know about it. It's interesting. And it ends up in a Miss Fish. Wouldn't you agree? I would agree. I would honestly agree. I, I've actually, like, I went snakehead fishing. I had this exact problem. Like, my drag was not locking down all the way, and I couldn't get the... You know Ryan Riggs? I know Ryan very well. Yeah. Yeah. He's one of our influencers. So we have a problem. Ryan Riggs is coming to us on April 20th. Yeah. Do we have anything to worry about? No. I don't think you have anything to worry about. You, you just got to keep up with him. Oh, I'm saying. Yeah. Keep up with Ryan. Yeah, keep up okay. with Ryan. That's what we like to hear. <laughs> you're looking great. I mean, look, you're styling. You styling? got what nice hats, nice clothes. What do you think of the clothes? Up. What do you think of the clothes? I like them a lot. Oh, what do you think of the material? Yeah, I was checking that out. Checking Pretty that cool. out, checking that out, checking that out. Now, Miss Vic's been waiting for us to mature for a very long time. A long time. A yeah, long time. They really stepped it up. They're looking they professional. Stepped it up. Yeah. I feel so good. I know. This is amazing. I never shout thought out, they were happy. Shout out Mickey, shout out Fat Bass, and Fat. shout out Miss Vic for just changing our lives. Every year we come here and we try and step up our game. Not for the money, not for the fame, not for the attention, but to get her trust and respect. And I feel like we're borderline there. Getting there. Getting there. Big baller shot, call up, pull up with the. Oh, I'm double mic'd up. Double mic'd up on a Tuesday. What you talking about? What's up, brother? I like that hat. I don't. Hold on, annual, dude. I, you know, I was like rep of the freaking year, Jersey Shore. That's fine. Dude. <laughs> Can you, what? you got you got the rope on you? I mean, I do have rope on me, yes. Let's do it. What do you want to do with it? You, what do you mean, you sell knives, bro? We got to cut that. I mean, there's a lot of things we can cut in life. 
Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's make a corkscrew. I mean, I don't have a corkscrew. You got the scissors. I mean, I do have the scissors. He's got the scissors. He's got the penny. Let's do the corkscrew. Uh, I mean, I don't like you that much. Do you really want to make me call this whole thing out from top to bottom, bro? Where this thing starts and where this thing goes? Because I just want to see a damn corkscrew. Are you at the top of the scheme? Come here, come here, come here. We gotta get you on the interview spot. You're gonna, you're gonna bail me out. Okay. Yak Attack, what's Yak good? Attack. What's your name? Uh, I'm Jen Muse. Jen, Jen what? Jen Muse. Jen Muse, I thought yeah. she said like Jen Muse. I'm a Muse. professional like, kayak Are Do you know our boy Gre Drew Gregory? I do. Did, were you on stage with him just now? Well, I wasn't, but he's my friend. Oh my God, oh, yeah, he's the man. He he's Yak you? Attack too, yeah. We're all team Can Yak we Attack. Can we swap hats for a sec? Oh, shout out our guy Mickey. He makes these, they're called Fat Bass. I'm really, really sorry if it's sweaty. That's okay. <laughs> Does it look good it with the good. tilt? Nice right. to meet you. What's your, uh, hold on, what's your favorite Kanye album? Kanye album? Yep. Oh, and I like Post Malone. <laughs> Post Malone? I'm kidding. Oh. I'm glad, I'm glad nice you're you. kidding. It's nice, nice to meet you as well. Yes. All right. That was great. We're out of, we're out, we gotta get out of Cutco. What you have here is called a recoil bait. With the rod tip, you load this lure, and then the lure itself recoils. And every time it does, it launches itself in that erratic dying bait fish action. Wow. The line goes through, and what you're seeing in here is there's a T-bar that's welded to that hook. Oh, wow. You got a right? patent on that? Exactly. Oh, man. Dude, it really looks good, bro. Do you think you could make like a shrimpy version of that? We got a shrimp and a crawfish. Oh, stop. Coming out of iCast this year. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is with iCast. Wow. You got a card, brother? Yeah. I need it. It's just so good to see you again, Mr. Swindle. Where is our friend Mr. James Watson? Mr. Swindle, that's yeah. nice, yeah. <laughs> Where's our friend James Watson? Yeah, 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 prestige worldwide. Is he really a friend? I mean, in our head, he's a friend. I don't know about a friend, he's just an acquaintance, you know. For us or for you? Well, just everybody, you know. His head's kind of bigger than his hat, you know what I mean? His head is huge. Yeah, it is, giant. Do they have hat companies that like he can actually rock? He's a model, he's really a, a test model for hat companies. They try to find somebody with the head as big as they can to make for, a like, hat. For like pygmy people, like he's a model? No, not like... really a pygmy, it's kind of like a, uh, what would you say, a gigantor head? That's what he is, he's a gigantor head. Like the Easter Island people. Yes, exactly, yeah. Stonehenge, yeah, he's, yes, remember yes. Stonehenge. Like giant head, tiny legs. Yeah, and like... exactly. That's it. You got it just right off the bat. That's what giant I'm saying. head, tiny legs. Yeah, exactly. You catching them? Uh, not good enough. Right, But right. I'm still catching. Just That's not... why we're doing this, because yeah. like, we, we don't want to catch yeah. them either. Yeah, exactly. Well, I've seen your videos. You, yeah, they're pretty good. We do catch them. Yeah, we catch some big ones. Yeah, yeah. The, my favorite one's the one where a giant bass Oh, you saw that one? Oh, yeah. 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 Giant bass. Yeah. Giant bass. That's a good one. Well, we had this, And like, he was just, like, ignoring him, like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> and then it's like, oh, my God, really? It is a giant bass. Well, like, we say like, giants a lot, and then, like, yeah. you know, like, our... It really was a giant bass. It really was. It what was. What that way? Well, that's the thing. We uh, we just think it's called No Scale Gang. Oh, that's We're the, very anti-scale. No, that's the, uh, well, if you actually weigh it, you can't lie about it. But we, that's why we don't tell anyone how big it was. Yeah, but... Huge. Where are you from? Uh, Atlanta, Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia, bro. Mar Marietta, more. You ever been to the uh, aquarium? Yes. Have you ever fished it? No. You planning on like the whale sharks? No. I thought about diving there, but not, not, not. Fishing. Not fishing it. No. What's your What's your favorite part about Atlanta? Oh, that's a tough question. I know it's a really oh, tough man. question. Uh, <sighs> man, Lake Lanier. Lake Lanier. That's North Haunted. Atlanta. Haunted, you know. It, it is. It Have is. you seen it's any like ghosts it. there? No. Have you had any, like, tugging at your ankles <laughs> in the water? Negative. Negative. So, create quick conspiracy. Where are you from? A well, quick conspiracy for you while it's on the top of my mind. We were at Lake Lanier one time. Yeah. And you know, like, the little dam release where it goes into yeah, the river? Yeah. So, like, we're thinking, like, maybe there's some, like, actually trout or smallmouth. I don't even know. We've we never been. There's trout. There's trout, right? Because it's cold water release. Oh, yeah. So, we're yeah. like, okay, it's probably trout. So, we try and go in there. And it's a state park or a national park down there. One or the other. State. State park. So we go in, Kai remembers this, and we don't, oh my God, the wife is there. Camus wife. Uh, it's so, <laughs> that's, that's up next. Anyway, <laughs> you know what we're talking about. You guys are killing uh, me. So then, so anyways, we go in, they try to get us to pay five bucks. Yeah. We're like, all right, we'll pay five bucks. They go, card only. What do you mean card only? It's a state park, right? Like, and they don't take American dollars at the state park. We're like they're trying to get our digital identification because it's a they, conspiracy. 
well, it's just, it's just all part. It's like this is where I started to think, what's going on in Atlanta? Like, what kind of craziness are we doing here? Like Lake Lanier coming in, building over the Indian reses, damming it out, trying whole, to get you into the town. digital currency system. Like, there's a lot going on over there, Lake Lanier. Yeah, Miss Janet, we love you. We talk to you every year, and I got a surprise for you this year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a bouquet of flowers from your own stand. I don't think he's having it. I don't think he's having it. Hey there, Miss Janet, how are you? It's it's our annual tradition. Yeah. We just have to do a quick interview spot. Do you mind? No. Camus interview. Okay. We, it's, no. Oh, I'm sorry, James. Oh. oh. <laughs> How do you now? Oh, these are beautiful. Aren't they, Jim? These are gorgeous. Aren't they? they are so nice. I'm so glad you like them. They're, very, I, they're local. They're locally sourced. Yes, I, like I, only, I, only like yards <laughs> away even. Um, we would listen. We would love to have that boat every year. Yeah, we try every single no. year. Well, just one year show, it's gonna work too. Just like to show year. you, we've made some. We made some progress. Yeah, we have. We have in in the world. Miss Janet, have you seen this video yet, Miss Janet? Y'all have fun no matter what. Oh, oh yeah. See, oh. Like, but look at those little boats, Rod. Imagine how much fun we would have <laughs> on a boat like that. Best marketing salespeople ever. Well, I like that. Every year we come back, <laughs> you know we're persistent. Yeah, you are persistent. And one day, you know, it's a, it's a compound interest game. Yep. And we're kind of at like that, in, like I know you're a businessman. It ain't a linear progression. It's that exponential growth. We're like right here. What did they say? This buy low? Buy low, sell high. Buy low, sell high. That's what I did with AMC when it this went is up. Like, this is like we're buying Amazon at $10 a share pre-split. That's mm -hmm. us right now. I know mm -hmm. I'm trying to talk your language.